The voice you're hearing isn't real. In today's video, we'll see how to how to clone any voice from uh, from your own to your favorite celebrities. Completely free and unlimited with AI. Don't forget to follow Malva AI. As you saw in the intro, today I'm bringing you an AI that lets you clone any kind of voice with a free open source tool. And you might say, Malva, why would I need voice cloning? It sounds complicated and pointless. It's not what you think. This power can massively improve results in many areas. You can clone celebrity-style voices to create viral content. You can promote your brand in a way that stands out. You can give more depth to story videos. And you can clone your own voice to automate every workflow that needs narration. Many YouTubers you follow already do this, so they don't have to record every time. It saves a lot of hours, and you probably didn't even notice. Today, I'm bringing the best option I've found, so we can replicate this easily, step by step. Stay with me, I'll guide you through it. I also have good news. In our Discord, we've released a new volume of our PDF, completely free for everyone who supports the channel. In these volumes, you'll find the best free AIs, tricks to squeeze 100% out of today's tools, and tips, secrets, and updates we don't share on YouTube. To get them, just join the channel's Discord. There, you'll also find links to all the AIs we're using today, plus the prompts we used. You'll see a bot PDF section. Post the link to the video you watched and one screenshot showing you liked, subscribed, left a positive comment, and watched the whole video. That's it. The bot automatically sends you the latest PDF. Jump into Discord. There are tons of other features. People share Sora codes, give advice, a lot that can help you. All right, let's get to the AIs. First, we'll download Pinocchio. It's a platform where we can run different tools, including AIs locally on our computer. That's another advantage. We're not uploading your voice to some website where we don't know what happens after. Everything happens locally on your machine. I'll leave the Pinocchio link in the channel Discord, along with everything we'll use today. On the home page, click Download. You'll see a guide with download steps for Windows, Mac, and Linux. It's as simple as downloading for your OS, unzipping, and running the file. It will proceed to install. First, you'll see the welcome screen. Here, you'll see the latest version, the folder where the program files will be saved, and the theme selector. I prefer dark mode. Click save, and that's it. You'll be on Pinocchio's main page. As you can see, we don't have anything installed yet. Let's install the voice cloning model. Click Discover. You'll see a large list of many models you can download locally. The one we'll use today is E2-F5-TTS. With this, we can use this AI model locally without worrying about accounts, tokens, subscriptions, and all that. Local, free, and unlimited. Let me know if you want more videos showing powerful Pinocchio functions for using all kinds of AIs. Once you've found the model, click it you'll land on its install page. Click one-click install with Pinocchio. A list of required dependencies will appear. Just click install and the program will download everything we need automatically. When installation begins, don't touch anything. Let it finish to avoid errors. When the save as window opens, click download, wait a little longer, then click install. When the install completes, you'll see an interface where we'll start working. Let's look at the interface. First, select the model we'll use today. We'll use the one that's already selected, F5 TTS underscore V1. Here, you'll find different modes, basic TTS, multi-speech, voice chat, and credits. After several tests, I recommend using basic TTS. If you want to generate multiple voices, do it in parts here, because multi-speech works a little worse. Now. Let's see the basic TTS interface. The most important part is reference audio. Here, we'll upload an audio file of a person we want to imitate, or our own voice. Remember to use this responsibly, and never with the goal of impersonating anyone. Let's upload an audio file of a famous person that we recorded earlier. To do this, I recommend using any online tool to turn videos into audio formats. We've left a few in the channel Discord. Once you have the audio, upload it to the Reference Audio section. 
Also note that if you want to clone your own voice and don't have any audio, simply check the microphone button, select your input device, the mic you'll speak into, and click record to capture your voice. I recommend recording without background noise so it clones exactly what it should. All right, to show you how it really works, we're going to test several voices to create the clips you saw in the intro. They're perfect for making viral content. To start, I recommend that when you write the text you want the voice to say, keep it clear and concise. Also, make good use of exclamation and question marks so the AI understands the context and narrates it correctly. All right, let's begin with the voice of a famous YouTuber, Mr. Beast. First, upload the clip with his voice. Hidden in this mountain is a one billion dollar nuclear bunker. Then, type the text you want him to say. In this case, the voice you're hearing isn't real. In today's video, The voice you're hearing isn't real. In today's video, Next, we'll upload a voice clip of Elon Musk. We have for the first time, we will have for the first time something that is smarter than the smartest human and make him say, we'll see how to clone any voice, from your own to your favorite celebrities. We'll see how to, how to clone any voice from, uh, from your own to your favorite celebrities. And finally, we'll use a clip of iShow Speed's voice. I want to thank everybody who watched the whole tour. I want to thank everybody. With the text, completely free and unlimited with AI. Don't forget to follow Malva AI completely free and unlimited with AI. Don't forget to follow Malva AI. As you can see, the results are incredible. These are just examples to help us understand how this tool works. Remember, you should never impersonate anyone, especially to falsely promote a product. But I think it's important for everyone to see what AI is capable of nowadays. Now I'll give you extra tips that many people skip. Click Advanced Settings. This is the key to generating correctly. To start, as we generate, even if the voice timbre matches, the tone can vary. So, if you generate voices and you like one, save the seed to disable random seeds and set the exact one you liked. Next, another very interesting option. Remove silences. If you notice the voices you generate leave too many pauses while speaking, check this option so it automatically removes silences and you get a much more dynamic narration. If you want punchy content, I recommend leaving it on, but always test everything. And lastly, as you generate, adjust the speed little by little until you find the perfect setting for what you want to generate. Leave the rest as is, and remember to test slowly, making small changes until you find the configuration that best fits what you're looking for. Now, if we've set the reference audio, written the text we wanted to speak, and configured everything correctly, click Synthesize. We can try a few more examples. This AI is really surprising. I also want to show multi-speech, in case anyone wants to try how it works. In speech type name, type the name of the person who will speak with that voice. Upload the reference audio. In the text box, write what you want that voice to say. Then click add speech type and repeat the steps with another name, another voice, and another text. Below, you'll see the text to generate general box. Here, as shown in the example, Put the name you assigned to each speaker in square brackets, and next to it, what you want them to say. That way, very simply, you'll have a conversation. But I recommend you use basic TTS and generate things in parts for higher quality. And that's all for today. I hope it helped a lot. Remember that you have all today's resources in the Discord linked in the description. With this tool, you'll be able to create super high quality content in no time massively improving your results. If you want me to bring more AIs from Pinocchio, let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching, and remember to generate with AI responsibly.